Hey, what's going on, everyone? My name is Chris. I'm here with Kathy. We go by Ginger Marvin on Instagram and YouTube, and we have another video for you today. It is Thursday, and this is the fourth time I've started this video because I think what's going on is I'm still holding my phone, my gimbal. I did actually order one yesterday, and it should be here. <laughs> There's a car driving by. It should be here uh, in a couple hours, but we're gonna get going on this video. I'm about to turn it over to Kathy. I think we have about 15 or so sales to pull. So here we go. <laughs> Hopefully that's the, yeah. the final opener. <laughs> All right, so. Yeah, we've been trying to ship every like two days, but we had a good amount come in. So yeah. let's just get them out today. So first thing that sold was this LL Bean. It's like a kid's jacket. Um, this was actually my son's. I bought off Facebook Marketplace a while back for 16. He wore it, and then I sold it for 20 with discount shipping on Poshmark. Nice. Yeah, so we'll ship that out in a Tyvek mailer. Alrighty, CX, another kid item. This is the brand Crew Cuts, and these were also my son's pants that I bought at Once Upon a Child. For six fifty, and I sold them on. Where did I sell these? Kid is in for fourteen dollars forty cents with free shipping. Okay. And I can't remember. Yeah, I think I just shipped through Kid is in, so their label's four fifty. So, yeah, not too bad. Very nice. All my money back, and he got to wear them. Too That's what I like there. to hear. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I would be nice if you made more than all your money back, but so, hey. I mean, I did. I think I made like, so when you think about it, like I made what, like two bucks probably profit on these and okay. lost about two bucks on that. Okay. So free. Our, our free kids goes. get to dress for free. <laughs> kind <laughs> <Most> of. <laughs> more or less. <laughs> um, so this Carhartt beanie on Poshmark, this I bought at the bin. So I have a dollar two cost of good. So I for 12 with discount shipping. Um, okay. So made like five six dollars profit there all right we're up six dollars on the day so far yeah. <laughs> i don't think there's any super amazing sales today like i mean they're all i mean to me all sales are great today. yeah yeah i don't think there's any hundred dollar things in here today just a lot of bread and butter these are some sketchers booties that sold to a guest buyer on poshmark for my fullest price which was 39 dollars um, I had an average cost of goods this day of nine thirty nine. So okay. pretty decent. Yeah. Sure. Man, I can't wait for that gimbal. I know. <laughs> My arms are already <laughs> tired. It's your workout for today. Yeah. So you, uh, slept in a little we did bit sleep morning. in today and skipped the gym. Yeah. Kathy's I'm probably gonna go back a little bit later. Alright. Sold these kid converse, so another probably breaking even ish. Um, these were my sons. I don't remember where I bought them, but I sold them for $22 plus shipping on Mercari. Nice. So, yeah, I don't think I paid. I mean, I probably made a couple bucks off those, but don't remember where I got them. All right, another mailer. They are under a pound. Okay, so CZ, very glad this finally sold. I originally had three of them, and this was the last, but... All of them took a long time to sell. I probably had these a year and a half, maybe two years now. And I don't get why. Oh, dang, I need to take this off. <laughs> this get the... a, there's a price tag on the bottom. Okay. <laughs> anyways, uh, yeah, these I bought retail arbitrage for $7 and finally accepted a $20 offer. So nice. not horrible. Yeah. Um, but yeah, it took forever. They're little cute Sorel baby booties. So yeah. I don't know if it was the color or just that they're baby shoes. But... And, and you are shipping out. them in the box because yeah i don't remember if i showed the box on on the thing but yeah i probably will um but they are what label did i oh i don't know let me check <laughs> i only have a four ounce label which is not going to include the box but i hope i didn't show the box right gotcha yeah i didn't show the box okay i didn't say new i said new with tag but no box okay so um, we'll take it out of the yeah, box and to keep it under the four ounces keep, yeah and we'll ship them out in the little, uh, let's do a purple ghost. Yeah, because you said that one took quite a while to sell, right? So yeah. shipping was probably a lot cheaper back then, too. Yeah. Which they just increased the price. We, we found out that pirate well, ship. Mercari, it's not, but. Oh, Mercari's not increasing? Like this person paid 372 Well, they're at least not. They haven't yet. <laughs> they probably will. Okay. But we found out today that uh, pirate ship is not 
increasing the holiday holiday rate, right? For the most part, it said. I think it said in the lower 48. So. Okay. Although, when I did check a price on a first class, it was the same as the eBay. Which but does have the increase? Or does not yeah, yet? Yeah, it does. Okay. Because it was like $4.12 for like a four-ounce package. Mm. Um, and then... But I shipped another kit is in sale through Pirate Ship, and that's where we saw that. And that one is where it said it. It, it like crossed out the 25 cents that would have been like that. <laughs> it said, we're not increasing the fees. So I was like, oh, I'll have to check on more eBay sales and see if there's yeah. any savings. And maybe, I know there's a way you can link Pirate Ship with eBay. Yeah. And just, it automatically puts the tracking, so... Many of you have told us that, and I which we've been, we haven't done it. We've been on eBay o- yeah. like over we two really years should. now. Yeah. So. So we're gonna be looking into that, and you know what? I'm, yeah. <laughs> He's gonna say he. I, I'm not gonna say it. I'm not gonna say it. I was about to, but I'm not gonna say it because I say it and then I never do it. We should though. Yeah. It would be helpful to a lot of people. So, um, I sold these Tevas. I actually bought these from Dalton at Dealing with Dalton on one of his whatnot lives. So the shoes were like $14, but with shipping and everything, I have a cost of goods of $19.50, and I accepted a $40 offer, and I think I just bought these from him like last Sunday maybe, so they sold really fast. Um, and I'm making about $15 profit for something that just showed up in my mailbox. All I had to do was snap a couple of pics and list it. Okay. Um, those are UPS, so we'll just use our own box, which probably just... Uh, Recycled boxes. Yeah, we did get those new boxes the other day. New old boxes. <laughs> this was that other kid is in sale where I used Pirate Ship. So I only used Pirate Ship on this one because the buyer lived in Denver. So okay. it was cheap. It was only seven seventy seven to ship two pounds versus a padded flat rate through Kitizen would have been like eight ninety five. Which the way they do their fees, it's probably coming out to the same, but to me I'd rather also, Kid doesn't have like a little tax thingy today where I was in the middle of updating my tax info with them and I don't think I could purchase a label at the moment. So Look like, at I'll this. Look at you just trying to get so. the belly rubs. Oh, okay. Here you go. <laughs> there you go. Uh, every time he rolls over, I see all that gray hair on the bottom of his chin. So, you guys won't see this video till tomorrow, Friday, but yeah. So, Kid is in, I mean, all the platforms probably. The, the $600 threshold for taxes this year. Yeah. Um, so Kitizen had like a note that said you need to update or you can't really sell or do anything until They'll you They'll stop so. you from selling, yeah. yeah. So just if you don't check it regularly, just know that when you, you might be getting a sale or not yeah. getting sales because you haven't updated. So just it was really quick. Well, Chris did it for us, but yeah. it took him like a minute. So just update your tech stuff. I feel like I didn't say what these sold for. So those are just like some little baby hammock snow boots. That sold for thirty one fifty with free shipping. I bought them for six ninety nine, and the shipping through Pirate Ship was seven seventy seven. So, okay, uh, BK. This was one of my newer retail arbitrage items. A pair of men's Under Armour like swim trunks. So eight ninety two was my average cost of goods on that trip, and I have these listed at twenty nine ninety five plus ship. Someone asked if we would do twenty. I just said, yeah, because this stuff that I'm paying up for like that, like $9, I want to make back my money as fast as possible. And it was about doubling my money. So I right. thought that was fair. Yeah. And yeah. So, mailer. Okay, box D. Don't step on Reese. I don't want to step on <laughs> Oh, you said his name. <laughs> you said his name. Reese, can you come in your bed? Sold another pair of Tevas. I kind of got freaked out because when I sold those other Tevas, I swear I delisted them like right away. And then this sale came in on eBay like just a few minutes after, and I was like, uh oh. I <laughs> it wasn't because they're both like titled Teva Universal, whatever. Right. Titles, so I was like, uh oh. So you read the first two words yeah. and you're like, oh no, <laughs> that sinking feeling. <laughs> but luckily we had a two of them. Pair, yeah. <laughs> uh, these ones I bought for $4.99. They're a kid's size, and I sold them for $19.96 plus shipping. And those are going to go in a mailer. Ugh. I need some chalk for my hands. Chalk? It's not what people do, like in pool and stuff. Like, just like chalking your I, hands. I've never thought about chalk. I've thought of, you know, licking your fingers, obviously, but that's no. gross. But 
I've seen they've got like oh, that. Got the grocery store with yeah, the little putty or whatever thing. it is or something. Yeah. Um, so this is Vionix for $39.95 plus ship. I bought them for $9.39 average cost of goods that day. They are under a pound as well. So just another one of these. <laughs> All right. And then CM. So some beezy. Like a knit navy blue like wedge. It's true. Bought those for $7.99, sold for $26 plus shipping. Very nice. And those are going in a padded flat, right? Okay. We'll do this one last because it's in that box up in the closet where we're probably oh. have to hold your phone. So <laughs> I see that. This is a Bior sale. Going out to TJ. And she said um, she was basically thanking us for the spreadsheet. Awesome. This purchase, it's a pair of Joseph Sabelle little ankle booties. Um, I bought them for $7.99. Uh, TJ bought them for $17.47 plus ship. So thank you so much. Sweet, TJ. Yeah, thank you so much. She's always watching, but doesn't usually comment. So yeah. Just her. That happens a lot. And yeah. we get it too, because we are the same way. We yes. watch a lot of YouTube, and we often don't get to comment because they just go one after yeah. another while we're working through the day. Starts the next vid before we pause and think about. Okay. All right. So we're going to switch. Is one. Oh, yeah, you so got open. one. And the other one is, yeah, that. All right, Box so with the smart wolf. Do you want me to hold your phone or? All right, yeah, there's no gimbal, so. Okay. It right. <laughs> should be easy to control that. Don't trip oh, over all of our trash. You're so bad. I'm not showing them the floor of our <laughs> closet. <laughs> it's just a bunch of boxes I'll show you. Whoop, some bubbles. Should we leave these down bins. and bag them up and put them away? Yeah, I do want to do that. So, so let's just put this down here then. All right. And by we, you mean you? Me? <laughs> right. So, one of these ones. This time, smart wool top. Um, so, these ones I bought for $22. The striped ones I think I bought for $25. But, uh, yeah, this one sold for $43.96 plus shipping. So, not too bad. Okay. Bag that up and put it in a mailer. And you're in, oh, you're I'm in blocking the, the mailers. It's purple. Okay, and lastly, this Woolrich Sherpa lined jacket. I did pay $19.99 for at a Goodwill, but I accepted a $55 offer on Posh. So a little over doubling my money on that one. Yeah. It's a nice jacket. And yeah, it's really nice. And I'll probably put that in like this large mailing box. It's a large flat rate. This one. This one. All right. Mm -hmm. Pretty good sales for the day. So let's uh, take a few minutes. We'll get them packed up and then we'll check back in. Maybe my gimbal will be delivered. I, uh, it says between 1230 and what, 245? <laughs> it's 145 is right that now. Gonna, is that like something that takes a while to set up? I don't think it would. T I'm just worried it might not have enough battery charge. Mm. We'll see. Okay. It's probably not going to happen. I'm just hopeful because yeah. my arm is They usually tired. come at the last minute. That yeah, they do. Stuff. So we'll be right back. All right, guys, got everything packed up, ready to go. No new sales came in. Nope. No new gimbal came in either. <laughs> Although it did just say <laughs> ten it's 10 away. stops away. So it's gonna be here in a minute, but we wanted to get this video done because it's 2.05 and we haven't had lunch yet. Or breakfast. <laughs> or breakfast, well I had, had a coffee. yeah, I had a, a Starbucks sandwich, I which. Mean, a coffee that's probably four or 500 calories is basically <laughs> breakfast, right? <laughs> <laughs> Liquid breakfast. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> So we're going to get this stuff off to the post office, go get some lunch. We're going to go have lunch today because it's Thursday and we it's our wee day. We just want to go out to eat and have some lunch. And our kids are off for the next two weeks yes. while break. So <laughs> this might be our last chance to have a nice lunch Without quietly. Them? And yeah. When is it legal to leave your kids home alone? <laughs> like how, what age? <laughs> I feel like, I don't know if there's a law, but like, I feel like, what does a good age do think? I was thinking Like eight 12. months? <laughs> oh, <laughs> just kidding. I don't know. <laughs> 12? I don't know. What do you guys think? What is, <laughs> at what age did you guys start leaving your kids home alone? Is it an age thing or is it a responsibility thing? Because 
I don't know. I feel like our kids are a little bit more responsible than some kids their age. It's a little less responsible than other kids their age. This guy's the least most responsible. That's true. What did he do the other day? I don't know. I feel like what, he did something bad. What did you do the other day? Other than getting in trash and stuff. <laughs> oh, yeah. He did get up on the table the other day. Got some oatmeal or something. <laughs> But anyway, <laughs> that is going to do it for today. Any final remarks? I don't think so. I'm don't hungry. Think so. <laughs> we're hungry. So we're going to call it here, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Thanks for all the support. We do appreciate all of that. Uh, I did want to mention we do have a live. We have a live tonight, which will be yesterday in whenever you see this video or, when, or whenever this video comes out, at least. So if you don't know, we do have a live show every Thursday night, 8 p.m. Mountain Time. And we would love to have you there. Come hang out, ask questions and just kind of get some work done while you're hanging out with other resellers. It's a really good time. So anyway, that's going to do it for today, guys. Thank you so much. And we will see you next time. Bye.